Mizu, Mizu. Hoć vađ. O, Amerika i. Nađan je, Amerika i vađ jok. Ok. Michael Jordan. Mi ko što nam vađ rođe? Ah, utejveš. Nađan huje beselek te probalok. A zna je Mario besela u skipeš? Jo, besel s angolu? Eee... Kičit? Ja. Pa dol igen, mitiland igen. Yes. Hej! Mitiland nem. No. Hej! Mitiland sija. En? En Willy Bajok. A YouTube one with Willy. Ladies and gents, how we doing? Welcome to Tata... Banya. Oh my god. Wow. Welcome to Tata Banya. Tata Banya. Piazvan? Uh-huh. Hey, Pigen? Hey, Pigen. Huh? The Nemma. Ne Nemma. Ah, Serednik, the Chuck. Yeah, Chuck Erika. America is a joke. Huh? Tevaja Piat Mester? Nem. Nem, csak állok. Nem, piac, csak holnap jön. Ah, Tata Bányája. Hozzum piac. Igen, igen. Jó. Erikes kis piac. Igen. Jó. Wow. Hogy hívnak? Itt a... Willy vagyok. Willy? Ah, Willy. Mint a Vilmos. Ja, igen. A feleségem magyar. Ja, igen. A feleségem magyar. Ja, igen. Amerikai vagyok. A születel Tatabanyan? Nem, Burva Novoszlovákia. Ó, a felvidék. Igen, igen. Vannak egy ilyen rész, az lehet dugni, így, és akkor ide tenni bele, akkor ide, hogy csak be kell rakni valahogyan. Yeah, kisebb, kisebb. Oh, look what we got here, a little lada. A little lada. And high up in the hills, we can see the turul. The turul, a mythical bird of prey with a sword in its talons. The sword that was dropped onto the Hungarian homeland to lead the ancient Magyars many centuries ago. Now we visited that turul on a previous trip to Tatabanya. What was it now? 2021, three years ago. Happy New Year's by the way, buwek buwek. So we're gonna leave the turul for now and the Selim Barlang, the Selim cave next to it. And we are going to head into Tatabanya proper, a place where I have never wandered, and I am titillated, titillated with excitement to see what this mining town, for that is what Banya means in Hungarian, it means mine, to see what this mining town has in store for us. Well, 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 if it isn't Chief Arpad, the man who led the ancient Hungarians into the Carpathian Basin, he's got a beautiful hat, and a slightly bent hilt of his sword, surrounded by the seven chieftains, Tuhutum, Huba, Tash, Kond, Ond, Elud. And I never know, is it Arpad and the seven chieftains? Our Arpad is part of the seven chieftains because it says on the little rim there, Almosh, which I thought was Arpad's father. Born to Emesher, conceived in a dream, all sorts of mystical stuff. Somehow the Turl's involved. Yada yada yada. Oh, Farshang. Busho Yarash. All right. And now we head onwards into Tatabanya, into the city, into the mine. Hi, yeah. Hi, yeah. Hi, yeah. I'm not going back to you. Shaggy, take it? Shaggy, take it? Shaggy? No? Ah, be wrong. Okay, okay. Yo, 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 yo. Erős vagy. Azért van, hiszelem, ne elvittem a szemeket. Jó, jó, szép napot. Mondjuk el, két hónapban a kóta. Két hónap, uff. Oké. Búik, búik. Nem búvodom. Köszönöm. Now, of course, Tatabánya, well, I shouldn't really say of course, but it's not an active mine anymore. It hasn't been since the 80s, when the coal was pretty much exhausted. And it wasn't always an active mine either. They only dug up the first lump in 1896, the year of the Hungarian millennium. 
There we can see the Turo. It's really the symbol of Tatabanya. My goodness, look at these great hunks of ice. Hotel Arpad, Turo, Selim Barlang. It was between the discovery of coal in the 1890s and the closure of the coal mines in 1980s that Tatabanya not only came into existence, but had a rapid, rapid expansion from its prior life as four independent, mostly agricultural villages into the sort of symbol of communist growth and industry that it did become. And Tatabanya came to symbolize the communist industrialization projects to such an extent that it was named the county seat, the capital of Komarom Estergol Medje. Oh, look what we've got here. A traditional butcher shop. What is on offer? Libetsom, Marha, Kakashtare. Okay. Take a little look. Oh. Oh, Yenyeru. Unikum. Wow. Unikum. Salami. Ah. Salami. Unikum salami. As a unikum is vaj. Chaka chaka dis. Ah. Uh -huh. Wow. Unikum forma figurino. Seretika fiuk. Na genia. Ima doma unikumot. Kasanam se pen. Se na pot. Oh, it's a turo. You see, Estergom, it really represented the old regime in Hungary. It was the seat of the Catholic Church, thousands of years of history, petty nobility, yada, yada, yada. Tatabanya, on the other hand, only became a real city after the four parts, Alshogala, Velshugala, Tatabanya, and the ancient Banhida, which had been a town since 1288, of course, of course, but they came together after World War II and soon thereafter, early 1950s, Tatabanya becomes the county seat, the Medjei Seik of Komarom Estegom County. And it was in the century between the 1890s and the 1980s that Tatabanya had thousands and thousands and thousands of workers move to the area, which is why you see so many of these lakoteleps, these housing estates, filled with the prefabricated panel houses, the panel hazak. Wow, look at this. This is most certainly not a lakotelop. We got Kate St. Mikros and uh, a school across the way there. All right, entering into Banhida, which I mentioned before is the oldest part of Tatabanya, Banhida. Great googly moogly. Look at the civil industrial engineering. Uh, let me tell you folks, it is great to make the acquaintance of another year. 2024, it's gonna be a wild one. A very historical year 2024 shall be. I promise you that if nothing else. But you know what? Forget about history, forget about the news, forget about the current events. Let's focus on the present. For I love nothing more than traversing these common areas. You know, the, the tourist sites, they're great, but it's really the everyday life that gets me more excited than everything else, and anything else for that matter. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. On the path, on the road. Azut! Ha <laughs> ha! anap! Itvan anap! It's not all uh, Lakotelos. We got a nice looking church over there, some colorful buildings. Tatabanya Ikutya. I think he likes me. Eclectic. Who's that? Ah, uh, of course, Mach Bela. No idea who he is. Oh, beautiful. Yo, setting shaked. And we've got the coal. The same as they call it in Hungarian. Yo, Serenchet. That's what the workers would say before heading down into the Nagyon Veseyes, the very dangerous mine shafts. And actually, just in Tatabanya alone, in the 100 years 
of mining history, over 500 workers died in mining disasters. Very tragic, very tragic. Yeah, we said that Banhida is the oldest part of town and we can see a lot of tradition, a lot of tradition commemorated here. It's the Slovak has. Very nice, very cultural. Is it open? Huh? Not quite. The Slovak has. Nowadays, there's only about 300 Slovaks who live in Tatabanya, but it used to have many Slovaks. For it was in the 18th century after the expulsion of the Turks that the Esterhazy Chalad, who ruled the domains around here, particularly in Tata, that's where the Tata in Tata Banya comes from. It's the more royal, the more fancy Tata, just up the road that way. Anyways, the Esterhazys, they said it's post-Turk times, post-Reformation times, counter-Reformation times. We're gonna bring a lot of Catholics back into this area, Slovaks, Germans, and there you have it. Oh, nice, Pushkin. Oh, great guy. You know, it's kind of sad nowadays. A lot of Russian history is being brushed over just because of Putin. But look, Alexander Pushkin, he's a legend any way you call it. And that is the Pushkin Mu Ve Lu Deshi has. And look at this for a bus stop. You can see the Turul on his hat there. Yo, Shopka. Fargo Tabor. Super cool. Don't really get a good view behind this pole, but uh, <laughs> oh, Ross Chunyanyov. All right, what well, we see here with these two swords sticking out of the ground, mm -hmm. some sort of World War II Mashadik Vilak Habaru commemoration. This lady's filming from her window, and I am filming from the streets. This is a nice looking memorial 1848 1849, the Hungarian Revolution. Wow, this is like uh the strip of the memorials here in Banhida. Memorial, memorial, memorial. That's gotta be Elshu Vilag Habaru, First World War, just judging by the uniform. Yep, 1914 to 1918. And it was after 1914 and 1918 that Hungary and Tatabanya, which wasn't Tatabanya yet, experienced their first wave of communism, Bela Kun, 1919. And it was in the counter-revolution afterwards that one of the greatest tragedies in Tatabanya's history did take place. Here is the Reformatus Protestant Church, the Reformatus Templo. We know it's Reformatus because instead of a cross, they got a star on the roof. Don't know whether these are Lutherans or Calvinists, but there's not much. Oh boy, yikes. Time for a new tire, buddy. Hate to say it, but it's time for a new tire. Uh, but anyway, back to 1919, September 6th, the Soviet Republic, Bela Kun Soviet Republic, had been washed out and the counter-revolution took hold. They started increasing working hours, arresting union leaders, and the miners didn't like this too much. You know, mining is a very inherently unionist, socialist industry. And so they rebelled, Guess what? They were shot by the gendarmes. They sent in the gendarmes. Pew, pew, pew. Many miners dead. September 6th, 1950s. The Soviets, the Soviet regime, they made this the National Day of the Miners. We are now heading away from Banhida into Tatabanya, one of the other three, four, excuse me, old villages. There was Banhida, Tatabanya, Alshogala, Felshugala. And what do we have here? Oh, lead me, little machka. Tatabanya, machka. Uh oh, he got a little nervous. Sorry, buddy. You're so tuki. Where did he go? Tatabanya, machka. Fast as lightning. I wanted to see Lako Telep today, and instead, it's like we're in the middle of the countryside. We got sheep, we got Libak, we got Kachak, Baranyok. Jeez, this is not where I parked my car. Hashtag rare. And look at this. It's like a full blown vineyard. Wow, cement columned vineyard. 
Love to see it. Love to see it. Would love to drink some of their wine. Hmm. Please, somebody, come greet me and offer me a glass. Oh, well. Perhaps, perhaps. If we had lingered longer, but the sun, which is popping its head through the clouds, is only going to last so long. I really love this. Thank you. Thank you all so much, Kusunum Sepen, for motivating me to make these videos. It is my dream. It is my dream come true to walk through the streets of Tatavani, <laughs> rambling to myself with a stick in my hand. You know, everyone's got to oh, oh, put it on a show for us, folks. There's the train, steam coming from the pipes. Vigia Zata Kutia. A little bit ahead of ourselves. I don't want this dream to turn into a nightmare. Could it be a sauna? <laughs> All right. Stay focused, stay focused, stay DHD. Yep, this is what we were looking for. Away across the train tracks. And I have a feeling on that side of the tracks, it's gonna be Kichita Lako Stelepeb. Kichit Lako. No, 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 no. Kichit Lako Telepeshev. Ot. That's what we're talking about, baby. Numbers on the side of the wall. This is the Shar Berek Lako Telep. Let's go have a little poke around. A little mosey. A little ganda. You know what they call a gagala geese? They call it a ganda. Here are the classic one, two, three, four, five story panel hazak in the Lakotelep. And they call them panel hazak because they're basically panels. They're prefabricated. Or they were prefabricated when they used to make them during the communist times. And they build them in a row and then just stack them on top of each other. I'm not sure how exactly it works, but I'm always fascinated by this type of cement. Millions of little rocks. Quite peculiar. Not so pretty, but functional. It will probably outlive everything else. And I haven't eaten all day, actually. Just an apple and a banana and a cup of coffee. Viva Las Vegas. We got the Vegas burger. It's actually the Manhattan burger, not the Vegas burger. Some cheese, some tomato, bacon, smoked cheese. Let's see how it does. Well, here goes nothing. Not the best, not the worst. Let's call it a 7.1. Oh, it's the biggest river in Tatabanya. Look at that. Wow, sunset, the gala, the gala patak. Okay, gala, gala, gala. That is the name of Alsho Gala and Felshu Gala. That's gonna be the last stop on our tour today as we scurry out of Tatabanya in the golden hour. <clears throat> we might not actually have time for Felshu Gala or Upper Gala, but we'll certainly have time for Alsho Gala. And actually, you know how we said before that the towns, the four towns, Banhida, Tatabanya, Alsho Gala, Felshu Gala, they united at the end of World War II to become Tatabanya? It was Alsho Gala that held out the longest. They were trying to unite since the 1920s, and Alsho Gala was like, no, we're richer, we're better, we're growing quicker. We don't want to get dragged down by the others. So let's go see why Alsho Gala is so <laughs> compared to the rest. And if it still is today, I mean, this might have just been in the 40s. Wow, all right. We're inside a lock hotel. This is suspicious. Okay, I'm not sure quite what this is used for, but wow, 
What a view. What a view. Your boat. Okay. Helen Dulung. It's a whole world back here. We got the pig shake, the fajizo, probably more of a summer thing. Grocery store, fatika, gyumo jizold shake. Oh. How is that? Everything you need. Very compact. All together. Community style. Could have a little bit of a second meal in that. <laughs> that burger's sitting on me like Santa Claus at the mall. Ah, Kodai Zoltan. Najan here is musician. And here is his elementary school, the Altalanos Ishkala. Probably after uh, Liszt Ferenc and Bartok Bela. Maybe Tifra Gyurc. Egyika legkiresebb magyar zenész. And as Kodai Zoltán once said, legyen a zene mindenki -e. Let the music be for everyone. So when you live in a lock hotel, if there's obviously no garages, and if you have a car, you store it in somewhere like this. It's almost the equivalent of an old horse stable. And this neighborhood, on the way to Alshogala and the Ovaros, the old town, is filled with quite big houses, actually. This is like where the Richie Richies live in Tatabanya. We're gonna head down here to the Gala Patak. Aha, some pipelines. Now, even though whew, the mines closed in 1987, industry still plays a big role in the Tatabanya economy. They converted to more manufacturing rather than mining and to this day, there's still a lot of factories around this neck of the woods. Just look at the mighty Gala. It's pretty clear, actually. That water looks damn near drinkable, although I do not recommend that. I do not recommend that one bit. Well, we shall wave goodbye to the main chunk of Tatabanya out there and head in through this little nook over there for the old town Ovaros and Alsho Gala. The sunlight is draining away rapidly. The problem with these winter episodes, they're over before you know it. I mean, we only got here two and a half hours ago. Fit a lot in to that time. Don't get me wrong, fit a lot into that time. But it goes too quick. Lovely. It's an Ungarn Deutscher Kindergarten. A Hungarian German elementary school. We can see the Maypole, May 1st, classic tradition, traditional clothes. And right through the buildings there, a church poking up proudly through the clouds. I love the looks of this place. Matyaj Kirayut. Yoit Vayat. Frisch. Mizu, Mizu. Hojvaj. Oh, Amerikai. Najonyo, Amerikai Vajok. Okay. Michael Jordan. Aisha Hojvaj Sok. Minden okay? Yeah, okay. Ah, Utevesh. Najon, who you best select? Proba look. Yeah, best as Angolo? Uh, Kichit? Yeah. Padol Igen. Mitiland Igen. Yes. Hey. Mitiland Nem. No. Hey. <laughs> Mitiland uh, Sia. What's your name? What's your name? In Willy Bajok. Many of you do. Many of you do. Many of you do. Many of you do. Many of you Horvat Ricardo. Horvat Ricardo. Horvat Ricky. Ish. Horvat Ricardo. Marcello. Oh, Marcello. Ish. Cristiano Ronaldo. Horvat Mante. Yo, Horvat. Also, Tesho. Tesho. Yo, any Isha Harum Tesho van. Igen, any Fotista. Liverpool a legio. Soboslai. Soboslai, Megedseb. Edge. Ketu. Ish. Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay, save the potential. Cool kids. They were headed to Felshugalo. We're not gonna have time for that today. Tatabanya. Visa Yuvuk. Persa. Persa Visa Yuvuk. As a Nyots as Kilens Ben Yots. To as a Kilens as Kilens Ben Yots Eeg. Yo Serenchate. The call of the miners written on the side. 
Wow, what a day it's been here in Tatabanya. That's all she wrote, folks. We're gonna get the train back from the Alshogala train station and skedaddle back home to Leonpalu. Kusunum Sepen, Tatabanyaik. Tatabanyaik. Kusunum Sepen. Ish. Yo. Set and chain.